people have to pay off a venue. Mm-hmm. But how can this be a long-term relationship and massaging that relationship before they even write a check? Mm-hmm. Showing them that I'm going to give you my best before you even, before the ink dries. Mm-hmm. So that you feel comfortable to write that check and you're looking for more opportunities to support me because I support you. So it's for me, it was all about relationships and, and these relationships I've been working on for years. It's not something that, you know, I just decided to send a proposal over six months ago. This is relationships two years, five years, six years in, in the making of massaging. Um, so, yeah, it's all about the longevity. It's all about the consistency. And it's also all about having that forward thinking. You have to be able to think for them mm-hmm. <laughs> and, and, and kind of outthink them in the process. Right, yeah, I understand that so well, uh, just coming from a background of PR. You, you have to be their PR person. You have to be their marketing person. When you say, listen, to, if you're wanting people to support what you do or sponsor what you do, most definitely. Mm-hmm. So the theme of this year's conference, let's, let's uh, shift and, 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 and you know, just build on the theme and why this, this uh, theme for this conference. So this year's his theme is all or nothing and the reason why I mean every year we go from one thing to the next and it's in alignment so last year we're building your empire while focusing on your family because a lot of people will get so caught up into this business that they're building that they don't remember that there's a generation within their own lineage that they um, that need the same uh, activation and so when you are able to build your empire while focusing on the family they get to benefit and then your generation can continue to live on so this year is all or nothing because in the process of building an empire and balancing you know some somewhat balancing work-life balance mm. there is a point where you have to look and say am I giving this my all or am I not am I am I willing to go even harder and stronger wider and deeper into this thing or not you know how committed am I to this next level of success that I can't even see for myself mm. and so this year all or nothing is how are you showing up to get that thing that you want without accepting everything else that's not the best you know, so a lot of us have been operating and been succeeding and doing good work. But are you willing to give your all to make sure that it's great work? Mm. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Wow. Yeah, so and I uh, looked at the lineup of speakers. So let me, let me just, this is May the 18th. I'm sorry, September 18th and the 19th. So that's a Monday and Tuesday, so everybody know. Uh, so... What are we what are we gonna see or who's showing up? I know you said something about you know people developing a platform. Uh, you know, on last night you you were all sharing trouble and I listen, so I uh, prepared. So what, what what we what can people expect to from attending this? I mean, so the speakers that we have, um, I'm, I'm big on connecting with those who have access to the media because mm-hmm. that helps, helps us to get our message out to the masses. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm also big on making sure that this is a global network of people so you're not just focused on a New York City audience or a D.C. audience or an Atlanta audience. This is going to open up your door if you come prepared and ready to connect with those from Buffalo. So the real winners are those who are sitting in the seat. The ones who are on front of the stage are just going to give us the how. Just what is it that you said? What is it that you created? Who do I go to talk to? What are their titles? How do I put this together? Um, you know, and so we want those who from the stage to give us the how. But the real networking and networking is in the audience. And so our speakers like Dee Marshall, she's an international sensation. I mean, she built... Um, her her girlfriend's pray movement is I can't even I, I don't even know what the numbers are to this day I think it's well over fifty thousand. Um, you have Tiffany the Budget Lisa who's killing the game right now from being a spokesperson to being a sponsored speaker. I believe that the audience needs to understand that what's the difference between showing up and being a conference speaker and a sponsored speaker. Those are two big different zeros at the end of the check. Um, then we have you know um, Dr. Tracy Lynn. 
oh, to wow. talk about how okay. she was able to turn her uh, jewelry empire from $200 to a multi-million dollar empire. Mm-hmm. Now it's in 48 different states and two, in, you know, two in two different countries. And how can we turn what we, maybe some of us are sitting on a direct sales business and don't even know mm-hmm. how to create mm-hmm. that. Mm-hmm. Maybe some of us are sitting on creating our own MLM instead of joining one and we don't mm-hmm. even know how to do it. So mm-hmm. some things mm-hmm. are not just, you know, um, for certain people, but I do believe some of us are sitting on some of this power. But until we ask the right questions um, from the from the leaders, um, we won't get the right answers to move forward. And so, I mean, I can go on with the lineup from um, those from Black Enterprise, those from our sponsors or credential um, to talk about, you know, money. How to, and Jay Morrison, I mean, he's Mr. Real Estate. And you, you can catch him from, you know, he's on the front line and, and Flint to, to go into marching for um, Black Lives Matter to, you know, um, re, you know, changing the communities and helping those within the community buy up their own properties. How about that? Mm-hmm. So that you can create and, 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 and keep your own community without having to worry about um, somebody else coming in to seize what's ours. And, and so, you know, we, we have some really great people who will show us what to do with the little bit that we have so that we can get much. Yeah. Wow. I, I'm, I'm really liking what I'm hearing here, um, Haki, especially when you're talking about all or nothing and using what you got to get what you want. And a lot of us in this day and time, we want bigger, but we have to start with what we have in our hand. Just reminds me of a favorite little story that I've read. But using what you have in your hand to get what you want, and and, and definitely uh, who I admire, you got one of my favorite people there, mentor, so to speak, is Tracy Lynn. And <laughs> wow, what an honor! Now, <laughs> Lucinda, now you know I was going to be out of the country, but I'm going to fly back just for you. Um, <laughs> I was like, I always miss your events, and you know I, we converse on Facebook or some kind of way. I'm like, I want to be there, but every year it just seems like I'm I'm somewhere else. And actually, I will be speaking um, in Canada. Canada. Yeah, I'll be in Canada. But you are so genius, and uh, thank you God that He booked at the right time because I'm just gonna fly back in my car or wherever, and I'm going to get there because you are exciting me. I'm taking my VIP seat, so say Charlene her VIP seat. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Yes, I'm coming. I'm so excited. Like The lineup is incredible, and you're speaking to my heart. I don't know about anyone else out there, but you are definitely speaking to me. It's all or nothing. I don't know if, if many people out there are living in a time where you've tried to build your business, and, and you just feel like it's just that warm more peace that you need whether that be financial maybe it's just a resource a connection to get you in the door to get you into the real estate market to get you into saving your money whatever that might be I don't know but I feel like activate activate is like it's going to be here uh, this Saturday what is it this Monday no, no, 20, 18th let's say Monday Monday. Monday and Tuesday. Uh, it's the 19th, 19th, 19th and the 20th. So we have, we have, we have about two weeks. Two weeks. Two, we got two weeks. Two weeks from today. So, uh, yep. Listen, I am psyched up here. I feel activated already, girl. <laughs> Yes, I yes. really do. So I'm. I'm. Gonna, your sister's going to be there. Rain, sleet, or snow, and it better not be snowing in I know, September. Right. But <laughs> I definitely you just pray for me because I want to be there for you. I'm so happy. It's in my backyard, mm-hmm. and what a wonderful person to actually, you know, come along. I, I do want to throw out the fact that you were there with one of my other good friends representing Miss Camilla. Um, yes, you were at the bed and breakfast on the other day and I was like, Lucinda, you are a strong representation of what it means to do business, you know, with women. So thank you again for what you do for Aww. the community. So thank you. Yes, yes. The wellologist, my girl, Candace Camilla. Oh. Yes, yes. Okay. So thank you so much. Hey, so thank you. You're such a doll, Lucinda. Oh my gosh! Thank you. All right, we, we're going to go to a quick break, Lucinda. How much? I don't know how much time you have, but if you know, if you can stick with us, so we can give out all of that good contact information when we come right back. I want to say this quick commercial, and we're going to come right back in about one minute. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you. Lucinda?
All right, all right, we are back. We are back. Do I have Lucinda on the line? Lucinda Cross? Okay, let me. So, I got to call on back here. Is that line clear? Let me make sure that line is totally clear. Uh, we'll try to get her back because we definitely want to give out all of the closeout information. And, uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see something here. Lucinda? Lucinda? Okay. Uh, let me see. Let me see. I'm here. Oh, I'm here. Oh, great. Okay. Hey, All right. We want you. We, we had you. I was going to uh, pick up the phone. and. Uh, okay. Let me see. Here. Let me get this back. Okay. So we have, uh, for you all that are checking out on the other side, we have Sister Lucinda Cross and I and my co-host here, Sister Charlene Day, and we were sharing uh about this amazing conference coming up here so let's give out your contact website information uh, landing page whatever it is you have to to share with everybody that for for those that want to come to this conference i don't know if it's just me i can barely hear you the music playing in the back okay okay can you hear me uh, now can you hear me now? better now yes, okay yes. All right, all right. Yes. that's better thank you i apologize uh so let's let's well first like who who are you expecting to attend this conference i mean this is not just for women uh so let everybody know it's not totally like i was up there there were a few brothers there when i went to new york so that was a blessing uh that you know you know you had a good mix of, of speakers as well so first who should attend this conference and and let's give out some contact, website, whatever it is that we have for people to sign up for this. Absolutely. So, yes, this conference is for those who are already operating in their vision mm -hmm. and, and, and they're already doing the work and they're looking to connect with like-minded individuals. So it's not for just business owners. You don't have to own a business to attend, but I guarantee you walk away with an idea in your pocket that's profitable if you don't. Um, we, this is a conference where vision and provision connects, guaranteed. Mm -hmm. We work, especially this year's conference, we're going to work on collaborations and partnerships, not just talking about it, not just talking about sisterhood and brotherhood, but what does that look like where we can both eat from the table and, and be profitable and, and be successful at the same time. So it's all about opening up doors and who can open up doors for one another. So if you are um, in the DMV area or if you're not, you can hop on the next thing smoking <laughs> and go down to, I mean, this is the week, the, the weekend will be the Congressional Black Caucus that Monday and Tuesday is affirmation. And so... Um, September 19th and 20th at Howard Theater. We'll be there from 9 to 3 each day. Monday we have a nice networking reception at 6 p.m. Um, at a rooftop location. So I'm excited about that. But if you want to get tickets, you can go to acclimateconference.com. Acclimateconference.com. And um, I would love to give away two tickets today. I don't know how you'll do it, but I would love to give away two, two or three tickets today. And that's the beauty when you have a sponsor. You can you can you can 
good in this. <laughs> because, um, yeah, so I don't know how you want to do it, but... Um, yeah, so that's that's what that's what's happening. Hopefully, they were the link down. Well, okay, let's see, let's see, Lucinda. Oh, you know what? I think one way to do this is uh, the first person that actually uh, we need the first three people. The three people. First of all, could they inbox you or let's see? No, sure, I can. can. Yeah, but first yeah. first three people that inbox well, well, Lucinda. Well, what, 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 what if they're not friends with her? So that may not well, work. Well, they ain't work. friends with her. Okay, so where they been? Okay, so exactly, because y'all don't even know. You must be sleeping for real. So the first three people to inbox her, her key, or me, because you guys are looking at. And we'll time. We'll look at the we'll, time. We'll look at the time. Well, we got right. this. So go on and inbox us and say activate 2016 yeah, right, right. Pacific. If you don't say that, you can't be like happy to be going to activate 2016 or yay. No, don't say any of that. Just do activate. 2016. That's all you need to do. Inbox Miss Lucinda Cross if you're friends with her. Activate uh, Mr. Haki or Charlene Day. Either one. We're going to timestamp this. So you have, and the clock is going right now. Cause she 840. Has, 840. It's 840. It's right. 840 right now. Yes. Three tickets to a dynamic event like this? Are yes. you serious? Like, awesome. with the <laughs> Lucinda Cross? Like, yeah, right, right, right. <gasps> Oh my gosh, like this is so cool. Like, please go, please go and do it like right now. Okay. All right. Hello. Hello, guys. So, we're really excited about that, Lucinda. Yes. Yeah, so. uh, thank you. Thank you very much. I'm sure that, you know, there are certainly some people that, 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 you know, understand value and understand that this is an opportunity that, you know, some people are, you know, hungry. They're, they're thinking to themselves, like, man, I. You know, I, I want to do it, but it's Monday and it's Tuesday, my, my job, you know, but sometimes you, you got to, you know, be ready. You got to be ready to show up. And, you know, she's done this in New York. And I mean, that New York event, man, that was at the, where, the was New York Times. The Times where, where Square. Was was Times Square, Square, right. The right. In Times, the, did you take over Times Square? She took over Times Square. <laughs> did she take over Times Square? Yes. I think she took wow. over in class. Did you see the background? Oh, yeah. The I background was phenomenal. Yes, right. I thought it was at the right. Broadway. Right. I mean, that wasn't there, but it just looked like Broadway. The girl is classy. <laughs> yeah, like, you talk about definitely. God and excellence, like doing business in excellence. Mm -hmm. Lucinda is the example. Like she went to some corny hotel. Sorry, sorry guys. But anyway, really, where you didn't know whether the food was coming from the back dumpster or where did you get that food? Lucinda is classy. Like I'm talking about first class. Right, right. I'm, sure. I'm telling you, advance. This is this is Lucinda. Girl. Lucinda said, "You know what? I desire to meet Oprah Winfrey one day." Guess what? Her events are like Oprah. And even better. So right, you right. gotta go see it for yourself. Yeah, and, no, no. And, and listen, again, activateconference.com. Okay, because if you don't win the ticket, you still win a ticket when you actually right. pay for the ticket. You are winning That's because right. of the lineup that she has there. Mm -hmm. Like that is so That's incredible. Right. So you still won a ticket if you didn't win these three tickets that we're gonna about check out, okay? So I'm telling you, go and register at activateconference.com. That's activateconference.com. Calm. You don't want to miss this. I'm telling you, you're going to be sorry if you did. Like, I'm going to be sorry. Like, I'm going to be, like, driving back the same day of my event. Like, I hope all you ladies are happy. Um, God bless you. And goodbye. Zoom. I'm out. Because I'm going to be at the Activate Conference right. 2016. I'm going to love you. But I'm, I'm sorry. Canada, don't be listening. But I love y'all, too. I'm going right. to see the Santa Cross and the family. I'm so super excited. Right. All right. So, yes, Lucinda, you got any more goodies you want to throw out there to us about <laughs> this conference? Because yeah. I, 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 I'm sorry, I can't compose myself. But any more goodies? Listen, I need to. I, I'm like, I need this energy. Like you, <laughs> you are amazing. I need that. I think you said it all. I, I just love the authenticity of the, the the energy. Is like you got me hyped up. I'm like, oh my god, I'm going to activate. <laughs> <laughs> She goes to her own conference. That's awesome. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. And 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 certainly, and, and I'll definitely, I'll be at the the CBC that weekend. I, I'm not sure. I, I don't know how much you coming down, uh, Lucinda. But if, if you yeah, I'll be there. I'll be there yeah. for the weekend. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. So if we you need me to, you know, do any little small things for you, you know, I'm 
I'm about working the room, so <laughs> so we, we, you know, I got got some inside scoops going on up in there. So, uh, so definitely, definitely looking forward uh, to that. Is there anything else you think that people need to know? We don't want to prolong your time, but you know, we're, we're grateful and we appreciate you know everything you you've been doing to transform uh, the community and for young ladies as well. So, anything else you think that uh, people should know about you and you know your, your your vision and what you see for yourself. Um, you know what I would say is that you know wh- whoever feels like they're stuck, you know, just kind of push push past that that point of stuck because you're probably trying to focus on perfection and 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 making it right for someone else. How, just work on making it right for God. Work on making it right for yourself, and, and just keep pushing forward. Don't stay stuck. I want everybody to get out of being stuck. A lot of times we stay stuck, and we're so close to our break, uh, breakthrough and breakout moment. So just push past, even if you feel like it's not perfect, even if it's a mistake, even if you're not sure. Just push past that point um, so that you can really see what's on the other side of the rainbow. Wow. All right. All right. So definitely. So we appreciate you taking your time out, you know, you, you, you given, you know, the core message for what people need to do. And of course, you have some YouTube clips where people yes. videos that, you know, that are out there and your website. So, you, you, you know, you're good with content. So people, you know, certainly can learn more about you as well as the uh, amazing speakers that are going to be uh, presenting there. And, you know, it's always some awesome individuals. So I say, you know, you know, come, take off, whatever, get free, prepare to get free. Uh-huh. Sometimes uh-huh. you just, you just got to roll and, and show up with the right people uh, at the right place at the right time. So that's going to be the place to be. So you have anything else to ask? Charlene? I, I, you know what? You know, I just can't wait to hug her neck, you know, <laughs> like really just be in her presence. I'm always in her presence, you know, whether it's social media or whatnot, but she's just like a, a real sister, real encouraging uh, a sister to let you know that you can do it and you could be anything that you want to be despite your past and I think a lot of women out there and men are stuck in their past and what they they did do or what happened to them and you know what you don't have to be there anymore you don't have to be the person to stay stuck and and, and find yourself in a formula that's not working she's already told you what that formula is guys she's giving you a lot of your 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 uh, back just right here on mm-hmm. this call mm-hmm the show tonight and I just want to encourage you guys again go to activate conference right now dot com like right now like don't even sleep if you want to be activated mm-hmm. go there go there this lady is the real deal this lady awesome. has been gifted to help activate your future okay and That's deactivate right. your past oh that was good oh take that into the voice of that good yes <laughs> activate your future and deactivate your past because that does not equal to what you are called to be mm. so again activate conference 2016 but activate conference.com if you want to come make it happen all right all right so we thank you sister lucinda we appreciate you again so look forward uh uh, to seeing you at your, you know, activate our activate conference, and you know, just keep up the good work. God bless you, and Thank just you. continue to to make that 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 progress and continue to transform. Thank you. Thank you so much. God bless both of you. And I'm going to have to figure out how I, I got to pay her for that slogan. That was hot. That was hot. I need that. I need that. I got you, sister. I got you. You need some more? I got you. I got you. Yes, <laughs> All right. All right. Stay blessed, everyone. Good night. Love good night, you. Good night. All right. Hey, Shari and Simi and Bianca. And I know. They all joined right yeah, on in there. Hello, Sarah, guys. Sarah was on. Alexander. Hi, Michelle. Michelle. Sarah Matthews, Michelle. G. Alfred. You got Palmer, a lot of Michelle. Uh, Lucinda. I know. Akina. Tim Alice, Jackson. Jabria. Melissa. Nancy. Gria. Terrence. Hey, Gria. Don, Terrence. They are wide open Don, on yeah, the line. can't hear. I'm sorry. You got, uh, and just a heads up, you got a... Uh, you got to uh, go to the site to hear the actual speaker. So that's a little process that we, you know, have. You want to tell them what site that would be for oh, them yeah. to go to next Thanks. time? E-Life mm-hmm. Media, everyone. E-Life Media. And um, Sister S. Monique. Sister Monique. 
Yeah. That's Monique Smith. Hi, Miss uh, Monique, Sister Monique. Michelle, man, that was Michelle, a lot Michelle, they were alive. Yeah, they William. were rolling with us tonight. Hi, Mr. Glenn. William Murray, William Murray. You had William Murray. We had Tawana and on. Jessica. Glenn Garns. Always. Yes, Darlene yeah. Kane. I don't know where Darlene Brown at. Where my do like where's my sister at? Is she, she wasn't there. Yours? Let's see if she's okay. on mine. Jabria. Okay. Hello. Joan Thompson. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, Lyric Hawkins. Hey, my sister. Oh, they were all over there. there. Yes, yes, yes. We appreciate you guys. Chastity, Mr. John, was on the on the line with us today. So thank you guys for chiming in as we had the Mr. Miss Lin Linda Chantine. Hello. Alice was on with us. Did I miss anyone? Steve, hi, and Charles Key, hi guys. So we gotta check That's out who so won those semi. tickets too. Yeah, yeah. So hopefully we'll we'll time everything. And shout out to uh, Sylvia, my queen. Uh, thank you. Uh, I don't know where you are, but maybe you're watching the real deal, not just yeah, my Facebook yeah, so, thing. So again, guys, so. if you want to tune in, because High Key is such mm -hmm. a, an incredible part of the community. He's always giving back and empowering the community in everything that we do. Guys, go to elife uh, media, right? Mm -hmm. dot com. Media dot net. Dot net. Dot net. Yeah. Dot net. Okay, e life. <laughs> e e life media, media dot, dot net. net. I mean, this yeah. thing is the ultimate media outlet. But you know, yeah. you know what's interesting? Uh, me and Sylvia, I, you know, I, I was at the Urban League conference, yes. and mm -hmm. uh, you know, I got this gentleman's book. His, what's his name? Oh gosh, wait a minute. Oh man, he wrote several other books, but his company is called Bith Group. He's, mm -hmm. he, he, you know, business guru. Oh, man, oh, man. But, uh, but he has this book dealing with strategic partnerships yes. and alliances. Yes. And myself and Sylvia, we, we're reading that book right mm -hmm. now. And you know, he's he's in IT and did all kind of contracting type of work. Awesome. So, but he, he has several books. His name will pop up again. But I, he's always around Maryland. Uh, business. Uh, oh, there she is, Sylvia. What's the name of that book? Sylvia. If you can, um, what's the name? Uh, what's the gentleman's name, Sylvia? If you can hear me, the name of the, of the uh, brother's book. Why you find it, or if you can remember? Oh my gosh, I'm having a brain. I think she brain. remembered it. I think that she's saying hi. Hi. Let's see. Preparing for me. What's the name of the book? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I ain't got time for you. <laughs> Sylvia, tell my brother the name of that book. <laughs> no, so I was trying to, Wallace, Wallace, Wallace Rob, okay. Robert Wallace. Okay, thank you. So, yeah, so definitely. So um, I appreciate, you know, the opportunity uh, for you to be on here, uh, Charlene. Oh, you no have problem. anything else you want to share? Oh, let me just shout out with Black Friday. They, they're going to be doing a Black Friday film screening. Well, no, not a screener, but they're doing that here. At the and CDC? No, at the um, at Everlasting Life in in November. So oh, I just just that. found out that that this was what was shown at um, at uh, at the Power Networking Conference. Yeah, Black. Yeah, uh, if you don't know nothing about this, it's Black Friday. And thing I have copies of that. It's just if anybody needs. Yeah. If anybody needs one, so the uh, truth about Black Friday, right? It's almost like yeah. about our community, about saving yeah. money, right, and putting it back into yeah, the so. community. And of course, I have some of the Power Talk three. That was uh, uh, what uh, shoot um, what doc it was at Reverend Willie Wilson's church in D.C. with um, Carl, Carl Nelson on fourteen fifty, so uh, A.M. So that was an awesome thing. Had that a few weeks ago, and we are still still uh, Dr. Frazier still working on part two part two for Mission Unstoppable. And this is, of course, Mission Unstoppable Part 1, everybody. So, and I'm doing some amazing things with that. Incredible but, um, book. But An I just, yeah, book. thank you, thank you. I just came from, a, a, you know, myself and Sylvia, we just, uh, this weekend, there was the Get Motivated Conference, and we went to an investment class, and, uh, you know, it, it, was, it was very informative. I haven't been to, you know, something dealing with stocks, but, um, you know, I, I, you know, I think that, you know, we have to expand our mind. You know, of course, you know, many of us are coaches, speakers, like what, what Lucinda was saying in terms of, you know, look, I mean, you may have, um, you may have, you know, a net, you may be on a network marketing company, but, you know, you also have to think about starting your own eventually. How and about so, that? Wow. You know, it's like, uh, you know, just, just always reinventing, you know, ourselves and, right. you know, it, and you should be, you should be transforming. I wasn't who I was 10, 15, 20 years ago. People see me. I'm like they they 
they like, what's wrong with you? You're, you're different. I'm like, yes. I mean, that's what you're happens. You're reading the people that <laughs> right. you're hanging around. You, this amazing yeah. guy, George Frazier, is enough. Yes. Like, yes. that would change your life all by itself. Yes. But I want to yes. hear about your weekend about that investing class. Just mm -hmm. a little bit of nugget about that because I, it may be someone out there that they really want to get into that. I think uh, a lot of our community... They're not, and I don't want to say they're not ready, but I think more exposure in our community is necessary. It, it is, yeah. it is absolutely necessary, and I, you know, I certainly appreciate people that that actually came out uh, to that, particularly in our community where we are not having these conversations. We're not, you know, actually, a lot of people when they reach a certain income, it's just like, oh, well, what things should I buy, you know, instead right, of right. spending money. There's an article floating around talking about spend money on experiences, not things. I love you it. You know, so, I, love it. Uh, I mean, many of us, you know, we, we, we just don't know what to do and we still have that that E quadrant, that employee or self-employed, we are on the left yes. side of, of, of wealth, you know, uh, uh, the left side of the quadrant, if you will, uh, of wealth and our thought processes and so sometimes it's like I I know I have to actually just deprogram myself you know from yeah. you know just just the employee mindset yeah. and employee mentality or and the people. spending mentality think you got to have everything yeah. you know like yeah. that's just mm -hmm. not right I just if you don't need it then don't get it you know like why purchase things that are not going to add to your life you know, me going out and buying a coach purse versus me investing in something like a George Frazier or this Activate conference mm -hmm. where, where there's a bigger network in the network. You know, it's like building my yes. network because I'm connected to the network. Like, mm -hmm. that is more powerful than wasting my money on things that will fade away, mm -hmm. that can burn away. But exactly. knowledge can't burn away because once right. you get it in your mind, it's like... Who can take that away? Right. Wow. Exactly. So powerful. And that's that's why you know after this weekend, you know, it just kind of shifted me just a, a, another level, right. you know, than than I had been at. And you should every experience is, you know, you, sometimes you just go back and, and it's like, I was wrong about a lot of things. Right. So, you know, you realize that you know it's time to step it up and. You know, you have to, you know, do that self inventory, that self Absolutely. evaluation in terms of your time, uh, you know, your talents, your treasures, and you know what direction you you absolute absolutely must go into. Because you know, from what I heard this weekend, it's just like, you know, this economy is going to go in some directions, and uh, oh for goodness. those that are, are not wow. prepared and you know have an employee mindset and no skills yes, and and no uh, financial education and experience and some level of cash flow mm -hmm. passive or portfolio income coming in right. uh, you know we're going to be eliminated so that's why I'm looking forward to actually the Congressional Black Caucus as well I can't wait you know I'm, I'm going to be up in there and meeting with some you know some people and now you know having gone to several of them over the years yes. you know a few people I think this me. year is going to be very significant. Oh, I think right, this right, year is yes. going to be so impactful at the mm -hmm. Congressional Black Conference because of, of what is happening right now in politics. You know, we got two candidates that are just there. And, and so what does this mean for our community? This weekend was like a real shakeup, and it was so good to hear uh, community leaders speak up, like mm -hmm. seriously speak up. Like we, we should not take a back seat when we can see uh, what's happening right before our eyes. And I don't think we should play with it. So, I mean, not to bring on our politic game here, but mm -hmm. still, CVC is going to do that for us this weekend. Next right. week is so I'm right. so excited about right. CVC and the conversation that we're going to bring to the table concerning um, our economy, our community, mm -hmm. and our government. I think mm -hmm. it's going to be a powerful uh, conversation that we're about to have there. Wow. Excited about that. All right. So, Charlene, so what do you have going on in the last couple of minutes? We'll just kind of, so you're, you're, you're speaking in Canada, right? I'm going to be speaking in Canada. Yes, yes, yes. So that's going to be on the uh, 18th of uh, this month, actually. Okay. So oh, that's a Sunday. That's going to be on a Sunday. Right. Yeah, okay. Amazing. Okay. Yeah, right. Yeah, right, right, yeah. Right, you right, have right, to right. forgive me because I was mm -hmm. like, I thought they was on like 
excuse me, like Pacific or Central Time. I'm like, <laughs> I was like, what time do you want me to be there? Are you sure it's not Sunday, which is Saturday? Anyway, guys, I got it right. I, I was just geographically just gone, right? right? But anyway, so it is going to be on a Sunday, Eastern Standard Time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I so said going through Buffalo, going to look at some things. Uh, my son and a couple of more friends will be going with me. Uh, um, and so I've been, I am going to be the keynote speaker for uh, a women's event the women's world peace day so i'll be speaking to thousands of women from across the world i mean these oh, wow. women are thousands thousands of women wow. across the world wow. so wow. incredible mm. and so feel so blessed because many of those women have been on ted talks and oh, things wow. like that mm. they're like mm. you want me to be the keynote speaker okay <laughs> holla hey right, right. Okay. <laughs> so i just think that it's an honor to be able to go there and be in a diverse community of women and you know what we all have our different views on life but i think when you're you're called to to share and empower a community it does not matter you come as you come as who you are like be who you are mm -hmm. and and bring the impact and influence that you have in your life okay because charlene is coming she's going to bring it all you're going to be talking about growing mm -hmm. right we're going to be talking about going so we're, we're super excited about what we have. We're going to be talking about peace, peace and parity. And, and that parity part is about the justice that's happening, you know, right here in America. And, we, and I'm definitely going to throw my Martin Luther King in there because everybody love our Martin Luther King and um, our Nelson Mandela. And again, if, if we do not, if we do not continue to fight uh, for our justice in everything across the board, we're going to find ourselves just stuck. And, you know, and again, like listening to Cross was saying, you know, it's time to get unstuck and activate that which we're called to. So I'm excited to be a part of that movement, the um, women's movement, and the World Peace Day in Canada. Mm. Think about that. Me. Uh, okay, What's uh, that about? What's that about? <laughs> it's your time. It's, it's your my time. time. Absolutely. Thank you. Yeah. Absolutely. So I definitely appreciate you. You want to, you got any uh social media or any website you want to give out for people or if anybody want to yeah. stay connected to you or befriend you however for joining joining us here sure i mean you can always go check me out at charlene a day um, dot com or you can come on over to facebook and check me out charlene day um again all social media is charlene day so check me out instagram twitter okay all what right. is it facebook Whatever you want, whatever, cool, LinkedIn, cool, cool. wherever you are, I am right there. I am Charlene Day, uh, here to help you grow. Not only grow you, but grow your money, all right? Grow yourself. That's, That's right. important. That's Number one thing, if you don't grow yourself, you definitely ain't going to grow any money. <laughs> all right, beautiful, beautiful. And I want to thank everybody. And next week, hopefully, we'll have either Brother Sh Sharif on or Roger wow. and Pat. Uh, so, and Roger. that's uh, coming up uh Roger and Pat, they have the book festival, the African American Authors Expo. Yes, I'm yes. sorry, in in Baltimore, that's going to be at Morgan at uh, October the fifteenth. Awesome. And uh, Brother Sharif, he's uh, uh, you know has an event on October the first at uh, at the Reginald F. Lewis Museum. So I'll be you know speaking uh, both there. So um, at both of those events. So I'm looking forward to that, and I'm definitely looking forward to the Black Caucus again. I am the Success Scholar Hakiami. Uh, you can go to my website, successcholarhaki.com. So, till next week, I say thank you and thank you, Sylvia, and thank you, Charlene. Thank Lucinda right. Cross and the rest of the activators. Uh, they getting pumped up doing hip hop videos. I saw Monique. That's Monique. <laughs> uh, uh, some Love sister Monique. Did, did, yeah. some, did some rap on there. So, thank you all for tuning in and listening. Tune in next week. Peace. <laughs>